Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Now today, as you can see by the title, we'll be talking about some new Black Panther War for Wakanda skins that were showcased on Friday night's live stream. Now, uh, there was a couple they showed, I think, what was like, four? We were, well, there was only one we saw, but it was a little bit more. And, um, honestly, I think it was an amazing suit. Um, and they showed us how to do, um, or how they kind of make it, make the skins, or make Black Panther, at least. And how they do the animation and stuff, kind of. But, um, other than that, guys, leave a like, subscribe, all that stuff. We hit 104 subscribers, so we had one more. So, welcome, welcome, welcome to the channel. We are trying to get to 110, so let's hit that sub goal. And without further ado, let's dive on into uh, this video. So, War for Wakanda, obviously, August 17th, so I am very hyped for that. The deep dive, um, well, it's not really a deep dive because it's now a live stream on their Twitch channel on the 16th, the day before, so I think that's where they're, where, oh. um, they're going to be showcasing, uh, their new, um, what's it called? I'm blank on the name, um, roadmap, because they did say that they're going to be showing the new roadmap very, very soon, so, um, I think that is when the perfect place to showcase it, honestly. So that is where we're going to hopefully, hopefully, hopefully see it then. But um, moving on to the skin side that they did show, um, there was four skins they showed. So with the first one, you can already saw like, the little screenshot we have already. And then now we're going to see the full suit of it. And it's the most dangerous man outfit. Um, I believe oh, what was the... I forget what... I don't know. It's a good skin, honestly. A lot of people were saying it looks like Blade. I don't know why I'm blanking on who this, uh, it's not T'Challa, but I know I made it in the other video. I just totally forgot the name of it, but hopefully you guys know what I'm talking about. But honestly, it looks a really good suit. Um, not particularly what I'll be wearing, but it looks very, very good. It's probably be one that is paid for, but very, very nice. Um, the second one, it's literally, I think they said it's called King T'Challa. So it's very cool how it's literally like, you know, him in his like little royal outfit and everything. And apparently they did say the rings on his fingers, they will act as when he's in combat, they will act like his claws. So I guess it's like claws will come out so he can do his attacks, which yes, we did get some attacks. The showcase, they show, show a light and a heavy. Unfortunately, it was weird how I was trying to edit it into the, into the video. I couldn't really edit it into it. So, um, but you can obviously rewatch their live stream to sh show it. Um, so don't worry about that. On the next one we have is, uh, it was hard to actually call it what, what this was. So I just said like the first appearance or classic kind of, I guess you can say, because it has the cape that we all wanted and loved. Um, honestly, this is one I might be rocking a lot because I, I just love it. Um, they did say, obviously, probably when I, they made this video, um, probably by now, um, the showcase the blog with a lot higher resolutions of these uh, skins and they will be showing some more skins um some people are saying that they're gonna show the first mcu skin um like like the day or no that wednesday or something so it'd be very cool if we get our first mcu skin that i'm using that um the next one that we got leaked or not leaked but was shown was um they said it was the str uh, str strategist one or Basically, the man without fear, when he took up the Daredevil man mantle, kind of. This is when he did not have any powers. So, um, honestly, I like how, I wonder if they kind of integrate the Daredevil thing. Because, you know, I made a video on the, uh, how, at least my particular Daredevil thing, how he would play into the story, um, the game. And, honestly, that would be cool if they have him come into the game at the same time as Spider-Man. Hopefully, like, by the end of the year. Like, they have it for Spider-Man since... Daredevil and Spider-Man are kind of almost the same. You know, like, they can swing kind of with the like, him with the batons and everything, like I said. Um, so it gives, you know, the Xbox, uh, uh, PC, etc., other players, then PlayStation just always getting Spidey. So that would be very cool. And obviously you can see there's the white suit again that we got shown for that second. But um, honestly, pretty cool skins. I love them. Uh, more of the classic, actually, or the first appearance. And T'Challa oh, was not too bad. But, um... And you probably can see that there's little snippets of, like, some screenshots I saw found on Twitter and stuff from the Play Avenger uh, uh, updates account. I th forget, like, fan account updates, whatever you want to call it, because he's a very awesome dude. So follow him on Twitter, actually. Um, but, yeah, you can see that there is, um, you know, like, little, um, like, the detail they said. They, there's so much detail. I love it. How they really put so much work into his iconic suit. So I cannot wait 
to see more of it. So, without further ado, guys, leave a like, subscribe, all that stuff. Wednesday, you will be seeing uh, my thoughts of should Marvel's Avengers go free to play. So, I'll be doing that Wednesday and Friday. Um, I don't know yet. Still trying to think of video. So, leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys on Wednesday for another new Marvel's Avengers video. Oh, bye bye.